because this equation involves multiply quantities specifically set equal to zero, we solve this equation by setting each factor, each multiplied quantity, equal to zero. So we will solve x plus 6 equals zero, and we will solve x minus 3 equals zero. If, for example, this equation was x plus 6 times x minus 3 equals 5, it would be mathematically incorrect to solve this by setting each factor equal to 5. We solve this first linear equation by subtracting 6 from both sides, and we get one solution, x equals negative 6. We solve this other linear equation by adding 3 to both sides. We get the second solution, x equals 3.